Hey everyone, my name is Ashley and today I want to do some pin unbaggings and unboxings. So the first I have is these plushables. These are what you can get on the back and I have the majority of them. I think there are four I need to complete this up that I started getting when I was pin trading in the parks this past time. And same with this one too. So it's a different wishable set. There's 16 of them. And I think on this one I only need three. So, fingers crossed. And then, on this past trip, <clears throat> as I was pin trading, I was noticing um, some up ones on the boards and then I found out they were in a series and I was able to pick up four of these in the park by pin trading because I guess people got a lot of duplicates of these so I already have um, I already have Doug I have Russell I have Carl in the chair and I have Kevin so I got two boxes because there's two pins in each of these to see if I could try to complete them. So we shall see. And then I'm a big Beauty and the Beast fan and this new Fantasyland pin set. I'll show you the back at the same time. It's all Beauty and the Beast themed. So it has a lot of bell. Um, some Gaston on there, the ladies of the town that love him. Um, so it's got a lot of good ones. And her dad, which you don't see in too many pens either. Since I've been collecting Beauty and the Beast, I'm trying to find ones that aren't even similar to what I have. So I'm going to see if I like these. And then I have a big Toy Story collection. And I know I've seen people unbox these and most people only want a couple of the characters. Anytime I collect something, I kind of want them all unless these pins are super small and I'm not happy with them. Um, but usually when I start like a collection, especially with the boxes, usually I want to complete them. Nine times out of ten I do. But there's people and there's characters on here that you normally have a hard time finding in the part like Wheezy, um, Jesse. You never really see Mrs. Potato Head, honestly. Um, Trixie. So just some to see if I can get them. I have tons of Buzz and Woody, but none of them look like that. So if I got those, I wouldn't be disappointed. But I'd like to try to get some of the other characters on these. So I have two of those. So I think I'm going to start with the Wishables. And go from there. And these are the ones for in the black bags. So I'm gonna look at the back because I know which ones I need. So hopefully this is always the nerve wracking part for me. I did not have spin. I'm super excited about that one. Fingers crossed. That's all I'm gonna say. It's like, you try to feel them, but you can't really. You're like, oh, let me see. Oh, this is definitely a duplicate. Buggy buggy. And he's not my favorite. So, I have to say it. He's just not my favorite. He's not a duplicate in this box, but he's a duplicate in my collection. So, he'll be a good trader. Alright. Another Winnie the Pooh. He's cute, though. So I might keep him and put him in my Winnie the Pooh collection and then leave the other one in the actual Wishables collection. So that's not terrible. But I do what I want. I'm trying not to jinx myself. Yay! Tigger. I did not have Tigger yet. 
love Tigger. And they're so cute in this wishable form. They almost look like baby Tigger. So I'm super okay with that. And I'm not gonna jinx myself. But it's hard to tell because you're like filling on it and you're like, what is it? Oh, please, 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 please. Yay! All right. So this is Olaf. And in this particular collection, I needed Tigger. Olaf Sven. Oh, I think I still need Nemo. I left him off. For some reason, I thought I, thought I had more of this one than I did. But it's okay. So, I've almost completed my set. So, all I'm looking for is a Nemo. So, if you need an Oogie Boogie, I know I have um, several of Constance, the Bride. I have a couple of Jack. Um, and I think I have a couple of the Pirates as well. Because, let me tell you, when I saw them, I'm, I was grabbing them too. Just because it's always nice to have duplicates of something so you can trade within that series if you meet somebody in the park. So, if you have Nemo and need any of the ones I mentioned, please reach out to me with a message down below. Because I would love to trade you. So, I got three that I needed and then this will just go in my Winnie the Pooh collection itself the extra oogie buggy in this one now the wishable the other wishables all right so I'm going to show you what it looks like, and then I'll tell you which ones that I'm looking for. I'm looking for Minnie. I am looking for the teacup. I'm looking for the bird, and I'm looking for the other bear in the country bear chambery. And these aren't in the blind bag, so I can already see them. And guess what? Outside. <laughs> now I'm only the one in this as well. So I got a Minnie. She's so cute. So that's good. I got the country bear that I did not have. I'm so excited about that one. I got the teacup, which I needed. Oh, come on. The backs are sticking. And then I got two duplicates. I already had Peter Pan, which is no big deal. He'll be a good trader in the series. So if you have the bird, and the bird I'm talking about is the, the bird you see in Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railroad, and then in the end, right before you get off, I need that bird. And if you need a Mickey from that one, or Peter Pan, or I have several Dantes, I have a Miguel, I have a Mike and a Boo, I have an extra one of those, I have an extra Lemire and Cogsworth, so whatever you need, if you need any of those, um, I need the bird, so leave a comment down below, but to only end up really with three duplicates of what I already had. It's not bad. Those are the ones that I'm going to be using to complete my collection. And those are my duplicates. And since the wishables took so long, I'm probably going to end up um, doing the other boxes in a different video. Just to make it not so long watching somebody open pins. But if you liked what you saw, hit the subscribe button down below, comment, um, also you can like the page, and thanks for watching, and we'll be doing another pin unboxing soon. Thanks guys.